What's going on to all my friends on Facebook and Instagram and my YouTube fans and my TikTok followers? Yes, you wondering, where have we been? Uh, yeah, it's been a tough year. Uh, I just want to thank everybody who's been coming down to the station house and, and everybody's wondering where we have been. Yeah, it's been a little tough times. Yes, Lieutenant Panther's back in the house. Yeah, baby. What are you doing? You got a little shit on there. I gotta clean your stuff. I'm not gonna brush your ass. Gonna... There you go. You gotta look good. It's... You haven't been on patrol with me since COVID hit. You rat bastard. Yeah, nah. Anyway. <laughs> oh! What are you, drunk? He fell down. What do you got? Your foot? Get your fucking sea legs up. Will you sit up there? <laughs> yeah, I gotta comb my mustache. <laughs> Welcome back to the channel. Yes, as you can see, wearing something different. The blue jean jacket Saturday. This is the new look for Happy Sunday Fun Day, along with Happy Lumberjack Sunday. Oh, yeah, yeah. And we have a new sponsor. Our newest sponsor is Southside Industries. Thank you for checking out our channel. Thank you to Dylan. And I just wanted to make, uh, give a shout out and to our newest sponsor as well. And previous to our other two sponsors, um, Strap Hangers Bar and Grill. And on top of that, Whiskey Roads. Yes, we are happy to have you on the channel. And thank you for checking us out. Thank you to our manager, Dylan. Thank you to... Our promoter, <laughs> Keegan, and our fans, and especially my number one fan, Ke <laughs> Kenny. <laughs> Can't leave you out, brother. So anyway, welcome Southside Industries. We we're looking forward to working with you to uh, build a, a good relationship and a good rapport. And thank you for checking out our channel. We appreciate it. Thank you, our manager Dylan, once again. So, here we go. So, the reason why Lieutenant Panther and I haven't been posting up any videos is because of family issues and stuff, work-wise and stuff. You know, thank you for all the love and support. We're up to 44 subscribers. And we want to make this channel grow. And we miss being, making, being with you guys and making these videos. So, it's more like a vlog before I go on a fucking rant. Oh, yeah. So... Let's get into it. Roll that beautiful beam footage. Yeah, right. <laughs> the thoughts of a rat bastard with Lieutenant Panther. Our thoughts on, if you follow me on Facebook, about the COVID-19 and flu shots, quote-unquote, free... Fuck you. Uh, up your ass. And the rat will agree. Of course, he's got to be like in camera's view. <laughs> Right there. Uh, 
I can't see because I'm going blind, going to turn 48 years old. It's imperfect. Yeah. So for anybody who's new to the channel, I am your host, Fire Marshal Will. This is the star of the show, Lieutenant Panther, and his colleague right here, the rat. <laughs> Be sure to hit that subscribe button. Leave a comment down below. <laughs> And we appreciate our OG subscribers and a year review of what was going on with this whole situation. So, yeah. Yeah, I know I need a fucking haircut. I'm gonna fucking comb my hair this way. Uh, whatever. What, you need a little comb too? Yeah, you love it. Anyway, the reason why Lieutenant Panther and I haven't posted up any videos is because of family issues and it's kind of hard and stuff. So, we're going on the fucking rant. Oh yeah, by the way, Tara, I'm going to enjoy something that I still have. Oh, yeah, I still got that wonderful chili. Oh, yeah. It topped that all off. Eggnog. So we're going to do our ritual. There you go, you ran a basin. Cheers. No, you're not going to have any of these just yet. Egg snog snot and snog. Ah! But I'm gonna enjoy that fucking chili. Oh yeah. Yeah, baby. Let me put this back in the fridge. Oh, it's gonna be a dangerous combination. Can I? Cheers. Uh, Lieutenant Panther, I haven't been out of it. I haven't done and posted up any videos where we're slacking. So anyway, thoughts of a rat bastard with Lieutenant Panther. Our thoughts on free COVID-19 and flu shots. <laughs> Yeah, fucking Joe Biden. <laughs> so, for all you fucking Democrats, oh, Joe Biden. Da -da -da -da. All you motherfuckers are living from fucking paycheck to paycheck. <laughs> Strap in, bitches. The fucking funny part about this is when we were little, I was born in 1976. I'm going to be 48 years old. <laughs> You know, as I was growing up, you know, I worked on the back of garbage trucks and I used to work in a, a dry cleaner back in the day, AWA, you don't know what the fuck that is, for all you old school people know what AWA is, that's a special chemical, so your clothes will be perfect yeah they were delivering 55 gallon drums shit like that but you 
anybody who knows about AWA, a uh, special chemical when it comes to dry cleaning, leave a comment down below. <laughs> So, no, one beer left. I don't give a fuck. I got eggnog. Even though I gotta go to work tomorrow, I don't give a fuck. With the fucking thing that I really fucking hate. Uh, you know, my parents are up there in age, you know. You know, they're getting older, respiratory, you know. Anything with, when it comes to the flu or cold. Their upper respiratory systems, especially my dad. He's got AFib. He's got a weak heart, yeah. My father was a retired New York City firefighter. At a, he started at an engine company 22, and he ended up in 44. Yeah. All that shit. He put his life on the fucking line. But the fucking hard part about it is, and this goes out to every fucking EMT active. I used to be an EMT. Nurses, this goes, this video is dedicated to you. And especially my good friend Tara, my neighbor, who works in the fucking medical field. I find it fucking disgusting that now that fucking Joe Biden is a piece of fucking shit. And I just don't understand. We have been defunded and our police officers... Our security officers. And a big shout out to Maddie. And everybody who's on my staff. In my company. Why the fuck are we getting disrespected? Because of what? Of fucking the war in fucking Ukraine. And the whole bullshit that's going on in, in Israel. But fucking Obama, who is now, who's actually running this fucking country. So, okay. So, I want... All you fucking trolls, so drop a fucking Nancy ass comment down below. And Lieutenant Panther and I are gonna fucking attack you in the fucking comments because of what? Because your fucking current president is a fucking pussy? And now we have to. That you. That your fucking current president is. wants to stay in control? Oh, that's right. Obama wants to stay in, stay in control because Biden is his puppet. Fuck you. We have 10,000 fucking people coming across our fucking borders every fucking day. The police, EMS, and firefighters have been defunded along with security officers. Do we give a fuck? We put our lives on the line every fucking single day. What? And what do we do? Oh, yeah. Catch and release, catch and release. Yeah. Kiss my fucking fat white Irish fucking piss hole and fucking enjoy it. Every fucking piece of shit that comes into this fucking country is undocumented. But okay. I can understand. I come from a Spanish Spanish background. But I'm going to tell you what, you motherfuckers. Go ahead. Attack us in the fucking comments. 
I dare you. Because I'm going to attack your fucking ass ten times as fucking hard. Okay? My mother came into this country legally along with my godfather. Okay? My mother back in the early seven, way in the early 60s. She came to New York. You know what she did? She became a fucking U.S. citizen legally. That's right. Legally. How in the fuck are you going to tell me that these fucking people who drive fucking trucks. Yes, this goes out to you, Kenny, and this goes out to you, Frankie. God rest your soul. Amen. How in the fuck can you drive a fucking semi and you don't speak a fucking word of English? Guess what? You take the fucking test in your own fucking language and you know how to fucking drive a fucking semi truck? My mother put herself through school back in the day. She learned how to speak English. She became a U.S. citizen legally. Legally, you motherfuckers. Legally. She worked. Right up until the point where she is at now. She's sick. And I don't like talking about it. My mother suffers from fucking dementia. Yeah. Something that I didn't want. That I never dreamed. But it came true. The worst fucking nightmare. And Kenny. You know where I'm coming from, bro. I know you watch my videos. I understand. It's like ripping your fucking heart out of your fucking chest. But there's a cure for cancer. But this really pisses me off. There's a cure for cancer. There's a cure for dementia. But our current fucking... Current... Administration doesn't give a fuck. What is what is our what is our current person Joe Biden does? He's like He falls down the stairs, he trips he doesn't know where the fuck he's at. He's like The whole fucking current administration is bullshit. You know what? I come from a family as a Repu that were Republican. How in the fuck when this all bullshit this whole bullshit happened? I get a fucking email from the voting how many fucking dead people fucking voted for fucking Biden okay and now you want to ban President Trump hey Justin wake the fuck up now you don't want to pay $190 because you don't have fucking medical insurance, bro? Yeah, I know how much you're fucking demoted and how much you kiss fucking Joe Biden's ass and you made fun of fucking President Trump and Halloween, bro. I'm sorry to call you out on this video, but I don't give a fuck. Why in the fuck you don't have fucking medical insurance. And now you're gonna... And I told you tonight... 
that you're going to pay $190 for a fucking booster shot? Yeah. And people are getting sick over it? I had freaking three shots of it. I don't know what's going on, what's lurking in my fucking body. Yeah, I smoke, I fucking, I fuck fires, I fucking drink like a fucking pig. I'm overweight. I used to, I used to be this thin. Ask Tommy. I'm not going to mention his last name. Because I know his sister watches my videos. But we'll leave it be. How in the fuck that I am an American citizen? My mother went through all the hassle and she was an American citizen. She doesn't even remember what day it is, just like our president. I was like, hey, I, 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 uh, uh, I, I can't believe they sang birthday to me. Tripping up the stairs in Air Force One, tripping down after the podium. <laughs> oh, we got to pick him up. And, it, and there he is with his fucking face mask. What the fuck? <laughs> and, and... I, I find it disgusting. But everybody, like... Like, oh, fuck President Trump. President Trump. Okay, so let me ask you all, you fucking Democratic fucking pieces of shit. I want you to attack me on fucking, on this channel. And I don't give a fuck, because you know what? I don't give a fuck about, because what? I got 44 fucking subscribers on this channel, because I'm not monetized, like, everybody who else that I follow. Screw that. It's about our First Amendment and free speech, and the benefit to carry arms, our Second Amendment. Oh, <laughs> what are you gonna do for the police? And and Joe Biden's fucking uh, House Speaker is uh, you're full of shit. Oh, well. <laughs> guess what? I hope they. It accelerate the impeachment process. You want it? You impeach President Trump twice. But let me ask all you fucking trolls out there. Because when I post this fucking video, go ahead, attack me in the fucking comments. Oh, Joe Biden's doing great. <laughs> Go ahead, go ahead. I fucking dare you, Lieutenant Panther, and I dare you to fucking challenge us in this. Because you know what? When I was growing up, uh, Republican, Democrat, <laughs> I didn't know. President Reagan was a fucking president, just like President Trump. That was a fucking true president. God rest his soul. So do your fucking history. Do your fucking research. My friend, my, uh, my promoter, our promoter, she wanted to go for a, an MRI. She was denied. She got health insurance. God knows how much she pays. Three, four hundred dollars. Uh, let's round it off. Seven hundred dollars a month, and she can't get the the you know the cat scan 
Fuck you! Yeah, right here. <laughs> what about our fucking veterans? <laughs> This is, this is our fucking president. This is the president, man. It was, it, 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 What a gas stove. Oh, we want our children to be, to go in clean energy. Wow. For all you motherfuckers, and I support PSE&G, in 2024, PSE&G is going natural gas, the entire fucking fleet. Because they're not going to electric. They got the hybrids and hybrid electric, all that bullshit. <laughs> and I support PSE&G. Cheers to that. They don't want fucking electric vehicles. No. The same shit would want to come again back to what we we're talking about. Because we're going on a fucking rant now. And we're not editing this video. And we're going to post it up just like, just like we always do. And we don't give a fuck. Because what? Because people who are undocumented, my mother got documented, and now she's suffering from a disease that hmm. yeah. Kenny can, Kenny can vouch for this. And my good friend that I served on the fire department. Because, uh, you know, Tom. But I'm not going to mention his name. Because I know his sister watches my YouTube videos. It's like taking your fucking heart and ripping it out of your fucking chest. And here is this current president. He's like... Uh, and then <laughs> Fucking really Wake up people I find it disgusting That I have to live from fucking paycheck To paycheck every week Seeing my mother She's like Kenny you, you can You can relate to this Yeah. There's another brother officer who's on a job. His name is not going to be mentioned in this video. But his wife was sick. And she's doing better now. Because he pours his heart and soul out. And he does everything to make sure his wife and his children are okay. Simple as that. What the fuck? I'm like, pay her ninety dollars. Where's that fucking money? Where's the fucking money going? Hey, where's this? Where's this fucking money going with fucking? Oh, fucking Murphy. He's like, yeah, you're gonna suck fucking cannabis. You know, we're gonna put the money back in the fucking New Jersey. 
Where the fuck is that money going? A hundred thousand dollars a day. Then you have to hire off-duty fucking officers. Have to carry heat. Are you paying them? Hey, Murphy. Where's that fucking money going, you fucking pig? I don't see the infrastructure improving the fucking roads. No, 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 no. Fuck you. Kiss my ass, wipe my ass, and suck my fucking dick backwards, okay? Fucking pig. You do it. You, you followed everything when fucking... De Blasio was in office. You followed everything when Cuomo... And here we are. Bullshit. You know what? I'm speaking for the, the our freedom of fucking speech. And fucking COVID. <laughs> Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. I dare you. And I want my fucking you. Um, not YouTube. My Instagram post. Please share that video. Okay, William eleven seventy seven on Instagram. Share it with your friends. I want that fucking video to go viral because I'm effective on on TikTok, and I want to get a lot of shares and views on that. As much as I want to fucking blow this channel up, I'm going to fucking do it. Because in 2024, if I have the energy, Lieutenant Panther and I have the fucking energy to do it, we're going to do it. You know? I take care of... You know, I... I do my thing, I take care of everybody, you know, I'm a supervisor, running a company, and that's all you're going to get from me, but Kenny knows, and he knows what I'm talking about, but guess what, you want to squeeze our fucking balls in a fucking vice, fuck you. And you know what? Our fucking capital building is unsecured. This fucking asshole yesterday. You know, like, oh, we got a fucking... And then they hold him at fucking gunpoint. Is he documented? No. Joe Biden and Harris. Catalina Harris. And his... And her fucking Jew fucking cocksucking fucking... Piece of shit, fucking pig, fucking Democrat. <coughs> Welcomes everybody. 10,000 into the country. 10,000 people a day. But when it comes to my good friend Keegan, our promoter, when she was denied... For an MRI. And she's got health benefits. And guess what? She got fucked. I got fucked. You know what? Fuck you. Fuck you. And fuck this current administration. <laughs> you know what? And fuck this whole situation. Okay? So now, I got a fucking recall. A fucking recall. Look at this shit. I posted this up on Facebook, right? Look at this shit. Right there. I called Toyota. <laughs> This isn't fucking Spanish. 
Okay. So let me let me rephrase that. Yeah, see that? I don't give a shit where my address is. You wanna come and visit me? And say hello? Okay. What it says is since I don't have medical insurance, my eyes are getting weaker. And I was like, why are you wearing fucking bifocals? Okay. So anyway. Electronic service requested. William Smith. Certain 2013 and 28. 18 model year RAV4 vehicles, potential vehicle related 12 volt battery fire NSTA recall 23 Victor 734. Okay, so now we're gonna make two videos in one. So, earlier this morning, I called Toyota about this fucking recall. They're like, oh. I was like, hey, how you doing? My name is William Smith. Uh, I got a recall for a battery. And like, oh, okay, okay. But I told, I told the fucking cunt. And I'm like, yeah, I got to recall. You like, I, I just want to make sure everything's good. But I had my fucking battery that died, you know, in 2021. No, I'm sorry. My my battery gave out on me in 2022. Mind you. So I call up a good friend of mine. From Toyota. I was like, hey, what's up, buddy? Uh, my fucking battery crapped out. I'm going to take it out. Of yeah, you saw the post on, on Facebook. And I got an 84-month... Battery to replace it with. I'm like, okay. They mentioned they they did the dimensions to make sure it was perfect. And then I get this fucking recall. When was this sent? I don't know. Uh, I don't know. I don't give a fuck. So, anyway. You know, I was like, alright, whatever. You know, my home... Ah, fuck. We're not getting into that fucking safety recall fucking bullshit. Uh, getting back to the, the the task in hand. The task in hand. I don't fucking like the fucking people that come into this fucking country and the fucking those Joe Biden supporters. Yeah, Justin, I'm calling you out. Yeah, I'm calling you out. Yeah, when you had that fucking rap fucking video, you got a hundred views on that shit. Yeah. And when I told you tonight that you got to pay $190 because you got no health insurance. Wake up, bitch. Welcome to the fucking club. And then the... Uh, uh, and on top of that, the whole political bullshit when... Our promoter, Keegan, needed a fucking MRI. 
and she has her, she has blue cross and blue shield and she got Did fucked I didn't ask you, Siri. Shut the fuck up. Thank you. That's gonna be another video. Every single time then you got like pop up. I didn't understand you, oh, fucking Siri. Yeah. Uh, I can't understand how hard we work. We work for our money, and we're getting, our paychecks are getting smaller and smaller and smaller. Smaller. <laughs> and this fucking Joe Biden. <sighs> Kamala Harris on the fucking, what was it, 20? 22 years. If you follow it on social media. And there she is. Like, <laughs> smiling. It's fucking 22 years of fucking September 11th. And there she is. Like, She was supposed to secure our fucking borders. That fucking cunt. That fucking, you know what? Fucking, fucking bull. Fuck that. I speak up for our fucking, our fucking veterans. Rob, this goes out to you. <laughs> Steve, this goes out to you. Why are you fucking pissing on a fucking America? You fucking democratic fucking pieces of shit. Why? Why? Why are you fucking pissing on our fucking... Veterans. Uh. You know what? I fly this fucking flag. You know what? I'm fucking pissed off now. See this? Motherfucker. See that? That's right. I want to make sure. There you go. See that? Red, white, and blue are fucking veterans. Yeah. 9-11-01. We shall not forget. What the fuck is wrong with this, with this picture? Yeah, Joe Biden's pissing on our veterans. Our security officers, our police officers, and Homeland Security, you defund us. What is wrong with this? What, Joe Biden? You're a fucking pussy? Yeah. 22 years. I have this on my, in all my uniforms. It's all about the fucking red, white, and blue, motherfucker. Why? Yeah. 22 fucking years. And we want you as president. Not You're not my president, fucking Joe Biden. President Trump appreciates... This fucking American flag. He supports our fucking veterans. That is correct. Right there. We shall never forget. Goddamn straight. Yeah. I should walk into the station house. Yeah, I got a fucking Trump. 
cap right there. Somewhere in this room of mine. I will find it. And I'm going to walk into the fucking station out with, with fucking pride. Because it's all about this right here. You. That's right. It's all about this. Right there. To all my security officers and our veterans, this me this means more to our veterans, our police officers, our firefighters, and EMTs and security officers. We got your six. And you don't know what what the meaning is. We got your six. Look it up on fucking Google, you motherfuckers. Whoa. Trump 2024. And I hope I find that fucking cap in this fucking room somewhere. I know there's somewhere in this fucking fiasco. But I'm going to be wearing that fucking cap, Trump 2024, or whatever, that, in the fucking station house. And you fucking motherfuckers challenge me. You want to fucking attack me? Go ahead. Because I support my fucking local businesses and restaurants and my fucking favorite bars. So... In conclusion, Lieutenant Panther and I enjoyed making this fucking video along with his colleague, the rat. We're gonna go and get some sleep because we protect and fucking serve. Fuck you, motherfuckers. Yeah. For all you old G subscribers, thank you for... <clears throat> looking out for us and, you know, looking at the repeats and shit. You got a new video going up on the channel tonight. Thank you for all of the support. And if you watching the channel for the first time and if you haven't please subscribe and lieutenant panther and i will catch you on the next one